Staying with the mission of camaraderie, we turn to a different kind of brotherhood. On the ice, a veterans hockey team in Tulsa has been fostering community through sport, helping former service members stay connected and compete. Our Braden Bates looks into how this team is taking the military spirit beyond this holiday. So here's something really neat. The Tulsa Warrior Hockey Club actually brings together about 70 members, all veterans, to play the sport. I'm 2 News Oklahoma's Braden Bates. I talked with the founder who tells me they're looking to grow even bigger in the next year. It's a truly team sport and it's like a battleground. Donnie Burig is the president of the veteran organization. The idea stems from his son. He found the program in St. Louis and it literally changed his life. It turned him around. It, it brought out they brought out the best in them, and I said, Ryan, I'm going to take that down to Tulsa. Burek saying it's a different kind of fight, one that challenges players mentally and physically. Out there and you want to support your team, but at the same time you want to overcome the enemy and score one on them. And, uh, but when it's over, you realize you're all in battle together, and, and uh, it, it's, just, it's just worth, it's worth every minute you spend out there. The team welcomes veterans and those who have physical disabilities with the creation of a sled hockey team. This allows everyone to hit the ice. The warrior hockey team is about veterans, but the disabled team is about all disabled people. So the sled program is open to vets and non-vets. Growing the sled hockey team is a peak goal for Burig. I encourage anyone and everyone, if you're disabled and you want to get out there on the ice, we can make that happen for you. We want to make that happen. We have the first sled hockey team in Oklahoma, and we want to grow it. Grateful for the team he helped build. At the end, you come off the ice, you shake hands, you pump fists, and you say, great game. If you're interested in learning more on the Tulsa Warrior Hockey Club, I've included more information on this story at KJRH.com. In Tulsa, Braden Bates, 2 News, Oklahoma.